Neptune. The mystery deepens tonight. A startling revelation has shifted the way we view the most distant planet in our solar system. For centuries, Neptune has been seen as the quiet ice giant, cold, remote, and predictable, orbiting at the very edge of the Sun's domain. But new findings now suggest that Neptune is far stranger than we ever imagined. During the Globally Streamed Symposium, astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson outlined evidence that challenges long-standing assumptions about the planet. What was once thought to be a stable, icy giant is now at the center of a mystery that could force scientists to rethink how planets form and evolve. Neptune itself has always been tied to mystery. Discovered in 1846 not by telescope but by mathematics, its existence was predicted after astronomers noticed Uranus drifting from its expected orbit. Later, in 1989, NASA's Voyager 2 revealed a world of violent storms, howling winds, and a mesmerizing blue glow created by methane in its skies. For decades afterward, it was catalogued as a cold, icy planet, exotic, but not exceptional. That picture may now be collapsing. Using the James Webb Space Telescope alongside cutting-edge Earth-based observatories, researchers have uncovered anomalies in Neptune's gravitational field, electromagnetic behavior, and heat output. Instead of being a neatly layered world with a rocky core, icy mantle, and outer envelope of gas, Neptune may be a far more chaotic place, its interior a patchwork of turbulent zones and hidden reservoirs of heat. The most puzzling part? This heat cannot be explained by weak sunlight at Neptune's orbit, nor by tidal heating from its moons. Something inside the planet itself is producing energy in ways science does not yet understand. Its magnetic field is another enigma. Already known for being tilted and offset from the planet's center, new evidence shows it may also shift unpredictably. Rather than being driven by liquid metals like Earth's core, Neptune's magnetism could arise from exotic forms of ice, materials that behave in strange ways under immense pressure. These ices may fuel powerful flows of charged particles, giving rise to drifting magnetic cycles never before seen in the solar system. Even more provocative is the possibility that Neptune is not a simple compressed sphere at all. Some scientists suggest the planet could contain chambers or cavities deep within, resonating with gravitational and electromagnetic energy. If true, this would overturn fundamental models of planetary physics and force a complete rethinking of giant planets both here and beyond our solar system. The consequences ripple far beyond Neptune itself. Astronomers believe Neptune migrated to its current orbit billions of years ago, reshaping the Kuiper belt and even ejecting another planet from the early solar system. If Neptune's structure is far more exotic than assumed, it could mean our solar system's birth was even more chaotic and violent than previously imagined. Adding to the puzzle are radio emissions that appear to come from inside Neptune, not from solar wind interactions. Their unusual frequencies suggest processes hidden within the planet's depths. Processes that may represent natural phenomena unlike anything seen elsewhere in the solar system. This raises profound questions. Neptune may not simply be a cold, distant planet, but a world full of secrets, perhaps even stranger than the exotic exoplanets discovered orbiting faraway stars. One possibility under active study is the existence of superionic ices inside Neptune. In this bizarre state, Water acts as both solid and liquid, with hydrogen ions moving freely while oxygen atoms remain locked in place. This charged, slush, could generate electrical currents, turbulence, and perhaps even the planet's unstable magnetic field. If present, it would make Neptune one of the most unusual laboratories of matter in the known universe. Its atmosphere also reflects this hidden turmoil. Winds screaming faster than 1,300 miles per hour sweep across Neptune's skies, the fastest ever measured in the solar system. For decades, scientists assumed that these storms were powered by faint sunlight, mixed with the planet's rotation. But the new evidence suggests otherwise. 
These colossal winds may be driven not from above, but from within. Pulses of energy rising from Neptune's interior could be feeding its endless tempests. If this is correct, Neptune would become the first known world where weather is not a byproduct of starlight, but a direct expression of a planet's hidden heart. Its storms, its blizzards of methane ice crystals, and its endlessly shifting clouds would be fingerprints of internal processes still poorly understood, forces that challenge our assumptions about how climates work on alien worlds. This possibility carries implications far beyond the solar system. Neptune-sized planets are not rare. In fact, they are among the most common types of worlds discovered across the galaxy by space missions like Kepler and TESS. Astronomers call them mini-Neptunes, or sub-Neptunes, and they orbit countless stars in every direction we look. If our own Neptune is not what we thought, if it is stranger, hotter, more dynamic, and internally driven, then those thousands of exoplanets may also be unlike the neat categories in our textbooks. Models of their atmospheres, their magnetic fields, and even their potential for habitability may need to be rewritten from scratch. Some of those distant planets may be hotter than expected, stormier than expected, and more alive with internal activity than we ever dared imagine. Neptune, far from being just another giant, may be the Rosetta Stone that helps us interpret the vast population of Neptune-like worlds orbiting alien suns. And then comes a bolder idea. Some theorists propose that Neptune might blur the boundary between planet and star. Though far too small to ignite nuclear fusion, its mysterious heat output, unstable magnetic field, and exotic chemistry suggest that it may exist in a gray zone, something that does not fit comfortably into our traditional categories. It could represent an entirely new class of objects, neither fully planetary nor stellar. If that turns out to be true, Neptune's reclassification would ripple across astronomy forcing scientists to rethink not only the evolution of giant planets but also the very definitions that divide worlds and stars. What else might exist in the gaps between categories? What other surprises wait in the cold reaches of space? What emerges as a vision of Neptune unlike any we once held? No longer the silent, frozen wanderer of the outer system, it appears instead as a restless and dynamic giant, a living engine of storms, magnetism, heat, and strange signals rising from hidden depths. Its interior may harbor exotic states of matter found nowhere else in nature. Its atmosphere may be sculpted not by distant sunlight, but by violent energy eruptions from deep within. And perhaps most astonishing of all, this may only be the beginning. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unmatched ability to peer through Neptune's shimmering clouds, is already revolutionizing our view. It can detect faint emissions, track changes in the magnetic field, and measure subtle variations in temperature with a precision never before possible. Each discovery has unveiled fresh mysteries. And as newer observatories rise in the coming decades, giant ground-based telescopes with mirrors wider than a house, and next-generation orbiters capable of mapping planets in infrared detail. We may discover even stranger truths hiding inside Neptune's veil. For centuries, Neptune was a shadow in the sky, its existence revealed only through mathematics. Then came Voyager 2, delivering a fleeting glimpse of its storms and winds. For decades afterward, it was left in silence, catalogued as a distant, predictable ice giant. But now, that illusion has been shattered. Neptune has emerged not as a passive world, but as one of the most complex and exotic bodies in our solar system. A planet that refuses to obey the rules. A puzzle that may hold answers not only about its own nature, but about the formation of planets across the cosmos. Neptune is no longer just the eighth planet. It is a challenge to science itself. It is a reminder that even at the edge of our solar system, the universe still keeps its deepest secrets close. And as we look outward to the thousands of Neptune-like worlds orbiting distant stars, one truth becomes clear. By unlocking the mystery of Neptune, 
we may one day unlock the mystery of countless other worlds, and perhaps even of our own place among them.